Hey YouTube, what's going on? This is Charles again. Um, I'm just showing you a little bit longer uh, video and uh, just to make you aware I don't really edit because I don't really have a lot of time. I'm working two jobs, working about 70, 70 to 100 hours a week. And uh, anyway, what we have here is a multi-cam black tactical tailor concealed carry sling bag. So these things, I don't know if they're in production or not. Um, I got this one under clearance. Um, I think it's probably just like a canceled contract, but I'm not sure how their their clearance goes. But um, you just got to keep checking in on those things because they have different items, uh, you know, every week. But um, let's take a look here. So I bought this just because I can carry my Birna, um, which doesn't really need a concealed carry license, but I also want to freak out people. Um, this is also a great everyday carry because it's only 14 liters total. Um, you can see here, what I really like about this is that you can, it's ambidextrous, or if I get tired, if I'm going on a day hike or work or whatever reason, I can do, you know, hold it on my left shoulder with this strap or the right. And then whichever way you decide to carry, um, you've got a, a stabilizing strap as well. You can also tuck this thing in if you want. So it just goes inside of this little sleeve right there. However, I like to carry it on my left shoulder. Thus, when I'm holding it, it's, it's this way. And then I can access a Birna or even a real pistol if I wanted to. You can see how it says. There is a uh, Velcro here. I can secure this. I usually just leave it so it's, it's even more easy to pull out. However, with this small Velcro on there, I can still access this with a good tug. This makes it a little bit uh, faster draw, so to speak. And if you've watched their video on this, this is not like a quick draw type of thing, but you can just carry it on your back, swing it back, you know, slide it back to your front, and you can access this back concealed carry pocket. You don't have to use this, so there's some reviewers that say they just carry like diaper bag type of stuff. Um, I put all the, the zippers on this side because I'm assuming that I want to uh, access this. You can see in here they've got some Velcro. I put in uh, just a rain jacket, waterproof jacket. And I have an admin pouch, which I also bought on uh, clearance. I don't have everything in here. I'm going to put in like a, a a pen and a couple other things. But that's what's great with this little pouch is you've got these little um, elastic bands. You've got a little pouch here with Velcro. I can put pens, different things like that. I'm not completely set up yet. For what I want to do with this. I doubt I'll update this, but possibly. So you've got Velcro in here, so I can just put this right there. Um, you can also lash stuff on the outside. So all I have out here is this little REI, kind of a like a travel lock. So then I can just lock this onto something for minimal security I and mean, it's going to delay them enough so hopefully I can uh, stomp their head in or something like that right but um, I just put it out there and then if I'm wherever I'm at I can kind of lock this delay them just enough hopefully on the front thing I've got some emergency food this is from uh, 
Pastelica in Finland. Um, it just has a smoked salmon and rye bread baked inside of a can. About somewhere around 500 uh, calories, I believe. Um, they give you this Velcro little organizer here. So you can see. I can rip that off. I've got a flashlight on here. You can put um, clips inside of there. So this is a clip for a Birna. Um, I've got a pen, a uh, permanent marker right there. Um, I really haven't put too much stuff in here. But for daily use, I, live, I work uh, four miles away, so I don't really need a whole lot. But I'm still not done building this. Um, this strap is very sturdy. It is pretty wide. It's padded very well. It's fairly well um, ventilated. Um, I like stuff with a frame because I sweat like a hog. But, uh, the, you know, the footprint on this on my back is still somewhat small. So it hasn't uh, bothered me too much. I've got a carry handle on here if you want to carry it this way instead of wearing it. And... Uh, We've got the multicam black. So I like the multicam black because it still ties in with, you know, like a semi dress or maybe even dressy stuff. Um, it's not overpowering on the camo and it's not completely boring, just like a solid black. This stuff is made in uh, the USA in Lakewood, Washington. And all of the materials are sourced from the U.S. The sewing on this is incredible. You know, they're going to use double stitches. Um, I think they probably even have a uh, triple uh, bar tack on these little lips. Uh, not lips, but uh, these loops, excuse me. And uh, I think on the bottom might be a thousand... Uh, in here but I know that everything else and possibly this is uh, 500 denier um, fedora so that's about it um, a lot of my associates that work for me think this thing's pretty cool and uh, I like the way it looks let me know what you think about it thanks for watching